What's going on everyone? Welcome to Rhinoc Cards. Today we're gonna be trying our luck with two Pokemon mystery boxes. All right, now I normally never buy these and for a good reason. Usually you don't end up hitting the chase packs that they call. They don't even call them vintage packs anymore. They just call them chase. So that's kind of like open to interpretation. Like, does that mean evolving skies? Does that mean cosmic eclipse? Does that mean jungle? We don't know. So anyways, these were 33 bucks plus tax Canadian at Walmart. You get four boosters and one online code. We're gonna open up both of them and see what we get. So we have an Astral Radiance pack. We have a Silver Tempest. We have Lost Origins and we have, what's this? We have Brilliant Stars. Okay, so kind of Kind of expected to get those. There's a uh, Pikachu V code for you. There are still some good things that you can pull from these sets. You know, there's lots of alt arts that you can get. There's a code for you. You know, like with Brilliant Stars, we could pull the Arceus, we could pull the Charizard. So we still could potentially pick some stuff up. I think Lost Origin, we can get the Giratina. So let's see what we can get. We got a Manaphy Reverse and a Heatran. Moving on to Lost Origin next. Silver Tempest also has the Lugia, so again, there are some decent things that you can hit here. Also, we have the Trainer Gallery uh, spot as well, so, you know. Even if we hit like a white code in these packs, there's still a chance that we could hit something nice in the reverse spot, like the Pikachu VMAX. Okay, that's not bad. I know it's not like super, super valuable, but this is still a really decent hit. Let's see if there's anything behind it. I didn't actually have this one yet, so that's a really nice pickup. All right, so we're gonna do Astral Radiance next. All right, so let's see what we have in this one. I think I can see, yeah, we can see something on the edge there. Let's see what we got. We have a Reverse Mill Tank followed by a Luxray V. Okay, just a regular Ultra Rare, but you know, definitely better than a non hollow Rare. All right, and ending off the first box with Silver Tempest, and then we're gonna dive right into that second box. Thank you all so much for joining me for today's Pokemon opening. I do truly appreciate it. We have uh, Obsidian Flame, I believe, is releasing this week from the point that I'm recording this video. So let me know in the comments down below if you plan to pick any of that up. We have something else back here. My goodness, Arcanine V. All right, so for four loose packs, that's not awful. All right, so second box here. Again, I am not expecting one of these chase packs, but you never know, right? There's always that small chance. So let's see if we have the same assortment of packs here. So here is a code for you, another Pikachu. All right, so we have Lost Origin again, um, Astral Radiance, Silver Tempest, and two Astral Radiance. Alrighty, so no chase packs, that is okay. We're gonna start with the Silver Tempest this time. All right, four to the front, let's see what we can get. Starting with a Fire Energy, Candice, Behem, Emergency Jelly, Ball Toy, Sunkern, Fan Peak, Indeedee, Marini, Dewpider, Reverse, and Noivern. All right, we're gonna do Lost Origin next. Let's see if we can get lucky and snag an Alt Art Giratina. That would be pretty sweet. I never ended up opening any uh, booster boxes from these sets, so it's kind of nice to hit some loose packs. We can see something sitting there in the back, so let's see what's... Oh, and it's a Radiant Sneasler. All right, so we got a double hit pack here. Radiant Hisui and Sneasler followed by a Berserker V. That Sneasler kind of caught me off guard there because I totally forgot about the Radiance. All right, not bad. I know we haven't hit like anything like monstrous. Like the Pikachu is nice, but I will just say like overall the uh, the total number of hits that we've gotten from these loose packs has been quite nice. These loose packs honestly have treated me a lot better than some of the collection boxes that I opened. Like for example, Crown Zenith was just absolutely awful to me. We have a Whizcash Reverse followed by a Glaceon. Alrighty, and the final pack, we got one more pack of Astral Radiance here. I honestly cannot really remember what is in Astral Radiance. Part of me thinks it's the um, Dialga and Palkia alt arts, but I really cannot remember. All right, we got two for the price of one there. We got a Basque Legion, 
and we are ending off with a Mammoth Swine. So all things considered, I think we did okay for eight loose packs. We had three Ultra Rares in the Luxray, Arcanine, and Berserker. And then we had the Radiant Sneasler and that Pikachu VMAX, which is definitely my favorite pull from this opening. Thank you all so much for joining me for this Pokemon Mystery Box opening. If you want to catch more card opening content, click the video you see on screen right here.